Hey guys, Kubing in here. Today we. Oh my gosh. One little second. Today we are looking at all the new, or some of the new, the majority of the new blocks in 1. Uh, uh, 1.10. I forget about that. So starting off, we're going to be looking at the blocks. So we have a bone block. Is that right? Yeah, bone block. Another work block. In other words, bricks, magma block, and a structure block, which is very unique in a way. Because when you, when you um, open it, it's kind of like a command block for, for map creators. Like, if, say if you wanted to copy that tree over there, you can, you can put one over there and say, like, uh, save mode. And then you save it. Then you, like, put a structure name right there. And then you can load it over there somewhere. So all of the four ways that a structure block can be used is a data block, save block, load block, and uh, corner mode. I don't really know that one, but whatever. So they're really, it's really cool. I really like um, what they've done with this block and all the other blocks. And this block kind of reminds me from or it kind of reminds me of that block from Terraria called Hellstone. Like, let's see, if I get some armor. Uh -oh. Nope, I don't know. Um, if I get some armor, then I'm going to game mode. Uh, is it one? Nope, zero. I was getting mixed up. If you stand on it, you actually get hurt. Kind of like Hellstone from Terraria, but this is not Hellstone. And it's just like one of those decorative blocks, I guess. But anyways, on to the next thing, which is um, this. Even though that it's already existed in the game, they made it like placeable. See, um, the blocks, they're all right here. And you can actually place them. See, I'm going to place one over here. Should probably equip this, just in case. Um, yeah, it looks really cool. And if it explodes, you might want to be careful. So if you hit it, like, or hold on, let me get more armor. So if you hit it, uh oh, you die. Like, it's, where, where'd it go? Uh oh, I think I just have lost the place. Oh, here it is. Never mind. So do not punch those blocks. They kill you instantly. Eh, scary me. Anyways, on to the next block, which, or, oh, well, we got all. The, yeah, we did all the blocks. Oh. But, I want to say something about this bone block. It is um, a way to store um, bone bone meal or bones, and it's really cool because it's actually a structure. No, it's not a structure block. That's a structure block, but it's actually um, like a structure, like a village. You can find it like uh, how can I put this? you can. It's like a fossil. If you dig in the desert or anywhere, I think, but I'm pretty sure it's a desert. You can find um, like dinosaur shaped uh, bone blocks and that made me think what if there's dinosaurs in the next opening nobody, ow and just before I go to uh, the new spawn eggs I need to go over two things I, I made this right beside a village so that's good and it usually has like gravel passageways but now it has this block which is, is grass but if you just do that with the shovel, then yeah, it's really cool. And it was first implemented on mobile, like the pocket edition version. So yeah, and I'm pretty sure I'm not sure if this has been in um, the the um, Java version already. But if you're on if you're a village on water, the passageways are um, wood, and um, if you find a village in like a savanna. They actually have like their custom village houses, which I think is true, I'm not sure. But anyways, on to the next thing, which is why it is called um, 1.10 instead of 2.0. Um, that is because, um, here, it's, so a major update is plus one, so like, plus one would be 2.10 which is a major update. A minor update will be plus 010, 
which just adds a few things, but 1.9 took almost two years to make, or almost a year. Oh my gosh, I need to do more research. And then a bug fix is just 0 0.1. Or is, yeah, that's right. And so we learned in fractions today. And here are some new spawn eggs, which I need to get a sword for. And so we're going to go over all the new spawn eggs. And some of the, most of these eggs have already been, or er, most of these mods have already been in the game, but they never had their own eggs. See, like, a cat would have been an ocelot, and then a donkey would be a horse, same thing with the mule. Then we have skeleton horse, which has been in the game, a zombie horse, which has been in the game, but both of those have been edited. A husk, which is a brand new mob, oh, a wither skeleton, I, I'm pretty sure that was already in, a stray. And a polar bear and an elder guardian. So, let's see. This is the polar bear. And if there's a baby near it, then he will attack because he's trying to protect its babies. And these things have a, a lot of health. See, if I try to kill. And they do a lot of damage, too. See, I have, like, diamond armor on. So that would be good. And I did well. And I gave him, when he dropped raw. Well, when he dies, he drops fish. So. If you drop polar bear flesh, I'll be very sad. But anyways, on to the stray. Oh, I forgot he burns his eye. Bye bye. Oh yeah, and I need to go over this guy a little bit. Yeah, I do really need to. So the stray is um spawn normal spawn egg. Never seen that before. But anyways, a stray is um will spawn in the same biome as a polar bear which is the ice biome, or ice spikes, whatever it is. And so here he is, he looks pretty spooky, and he inflicts you with arrows of slowness. And there is a chance that he will drop arrows of slowness. And it's really cool, because that might be one of my favorite um, mobs now. And now on to the next mob, which is a husk, which is a replacement, or not a replacement, but... Oh no, why does it have to be a baby? Anyways, these guys spawn in, um, the husks spawn in, uh, what's it called? Ah, uh, dang it, I can't think today. They spawn in desert biomes, so, they're kind of a replacement. I keep saying replacement. They're like a new version of the zombies. Same thing with the, uh, stray. But they're just, like, cooler versions that can survive in daylight, except for the stray. But anyways. We are on to the zombie horse, and they edited these, these guys, so... When you kill them, they just drop normal um, things of horse wood. But if you kill them, they will they will drop like the principal things like rotten flesh. There it is. And if you spawn the skeleton horse. He will of course drop bones. Am I talking that way? Then we have the mule, this donkey, and the kitty cat. No, oh kitty cat! I thought you were tamed already. Oh, all right. Anyways. I think that's it actually. Oh no, we have the Elder Guardian. Let's be ready for this one. Because I'm really not ready. And so these guys are huge. These guys were implemented in the 0 0.8 or 1.8 update, I'm pretty sure. Okay, yeah, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. So that is pretty much it for the new. Um, oh my gosh, I can barely think of it. 1.10 update. And this, this update will be a lot of fun, I can tell, but. If you don't like long update, if you like longer updates better than shorter updates, um, that's, that's real. Are you kidding me? <laughs> God dang it. <laughs> no, I give up. I give up. I, yes, I give up. But anyways, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, give it a like. And, oh, I didn't mean to do that, but die, 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 die. And that little bird was just flopping all over the place. But I um, am looking up when the 1.10 update is coming out. Release date. Um, I couldn't find a release date. So I don't think I'm going to try to look for it anymore. And I'm just going to go YOLO on this little, um, this big elder guardian right here. Da -da 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 -da. Right, never mind. Bye.